All right, so Behance and Dribble have gone old, saturated. Today, I've gathered some of the best alternatives for Dribble and Behance. And some of these have some really unique features around jobs, opportunities, showcasing, and so much more. So let's look at all these three alternatives that I'm super excited to show you. The first one has to be Peerless. This is a new LinkedIn-like platform. And here you can have your own profile, like I've listed myself. I have my expertise, where I live, and I can also showcase my other platforms like Dribble, GitHub, Product Hunt, Substack, whatever I like, as well as add a blank project. Something similar to what you can do with Behance. But the best part is here you can link your website, your Behance, whatever, and it will showcase it on the page itself. You can even link your social medias and it, a lot of your content will be displayed like I've displayed my YouTube here. Cool thing is you have your own set of analytics here. So it's not just showcasing your designs, but also checking out the kind of people who are viewing your designs, etc. You can even put up things like your resumes. You can vouch for other designers. So if you have friends who want to do this together, you can vouch for each other or you can ask for like a recommendation from someone. You also have social posts. So unlike Behance and Dribble, here you can do the usual social media stuff that you generally get to do on LinkedIn. You can even have company profiles and inside that company profile, you can have its own social as well as you can put up your designs. If you have a design studio, this can be super helpful. Now they have their own project spotlight. So much like Dribble and Behance, the top designs and projects that you're creating will land up here. So if Dribble and LinkedIn had a child, it would be peerless, I would say. This one's purely for designers. This is called Layers.2. And much like Dribble, it has this kind of showcase page with popular and work in progress as well. So if your design becomes popular, it comes up here. If you are working on something or there are certain wireframes, etc., then you can put it up here as well and showcase it as work in progress. Also have something called recent signups. So if you're a newbie, people can view you here as well. After this video launches in a day or two, I'll check out some of you guys here as well. And they have trending tags. So if there is Figma, if Figma is trending, if there's a new feature, Figma might trend. Okay. Now at the top left is where the magic happens. So there is your explore page, which is your generic page. Then you have your designers page. So you can sign up here and become a proper designer that companies can hire. This particular page comes with a small price tag of $9 a month. However, if you're a freelancer or if you have a studio, whatever it might be, you can check this out and maybe try it out for a month just to see if it works out for you. Then of course you have a job board. 100% free. You can even post a job if you're a company looking for designers. Now this next one is where the community aspect becomes even a level higher. So UX Hack is a platform where 8,000 plus designers meet, talk, design together, and they even have like UX hackathons, etc. As you can see, they have an events tab. So there is a thank God it's Friday. So there are quizzes on Fridays. They also have a Telegram and WhatsApp groups. So if that's your kind of thing, you can even get that here. So again, a wonderful niche platform to check out various different things, share your designs with the community directly instead of with trying to share it with the world where it gets very little recognition. Okay, so if you're the kind of person who likes platforms closer to Dribble and Behance, Uplabs is one for you. Uplabs is a platform that started many years ago and I was one of the first users of Uplabs. This place is both a showcase website as well as a marketplace. So if you want to showcase your designs that you've made and you'll get recognition from their thousands of users who are active daily. You can actually sell your designs on this platform. So if you made a design, you can actually sell it. There are a lot of premium downloads as you can see here. This is $29 for a purchase. However, the people have actually subscribed to this platform to get resources. What's special about this platform is its challenges. So if you check out their challenges, there are challenges happening every two or three weeks or so. As you can see, there are four active challenges. Hundreds of people are participating and each challenger kind of gets a little prize as well as a showcase on top of the website like this. These challenges are more like competitions where your designs, the top design gets voted by the community and gets to the top as well. So you can get a lot of recognition through this platform, especially if you're a competitive guy like me and you want to be on top 
as usual. They also have a blog called Uplab Success Stories. It essentially covers all the success stories who are making thousands of dollars a month using Uplabs and how you can do that as well. So this is a great earning potential as well as a showcase potential for you guys. Okay, things are now getting a little serious. OnePageLove.com. It sounds like a dating website, but it's not. Now this is a platform which is there almost from the start of when internet became popular. And it has 150,000 dedicated designers on the platform looking at your designs. It's dedicated to one page websites. So if you're a website designer or if you've designed websites in your UI design process, you can get to the platform and actually upload your designs. Cool thing is you can add what features there are on the website, which tools you've used, different categories. Under the info tab, you will find the submit button and they only submit the best of the best. So if you think you're really good at your designs or you should show it on this platform, the submit button is here. Apart from that, they have various resources to learn as well. So you've, you'll find a lot of templates that you can kind of pick up, free templates that you can use. And they have a job board as well. So if you click on hire, it takes you to a dedicated job board. And on this job board, you'll find a lot of popular designers that you even know from YouTube and Instagram. Since we're being serious, let's talk about bestfolios.com. Now this is the platform to showcase your design portfolio portfolios in 2024. The first page itself showcases some of the editor's picks. So if your portfolio is really beautiful, really good, then the editor might put it up here. They have a lot of different resources like all the other websites as well. You can upload a lot of things here. You can upload your resumes, you can upload your portfolio that might be built on a different platform. And you can find some of the most popular portfolios created by the best companies in the world. And you have a dedicated case studies tab as well. So if you have a particular case study that you're proud of, you want to showcase on the platform, you can submit that as well. Okay, so if we're looking at communities, I really wanted to give a shout out to this niche community platform called Twitter. Now, Twitter has a new platform called Communities. It's a tab that you can find here. And they have a lot of different design communities to check out and to be a part of. You even might get to share your designs there. So for example, Design Systems is a dedicated community of its own. You can ask to join and then you can check out everyone who is posting here as well. So you might even get to post your designs or to share your work to, to a mass of people. Now, of course, you have niche, more niche communities around tech, music, fonts, for God's sakes. But this is an amazing platform to check out because we don't find a lot of niche communities these days and this is definitely a hidden gem if I am talking about it myself. This is kind of, this reminds me of Facebook groups which used to be super cool back in the day. Now they kind of died out, but definitely a great place to start your niche career from. All right guys, so that was it for today's video. I enjoyed making this one on my phone for a change. If you did like a thumbs up would be super helpful as well as sharing this video with your friends and your folks would be an even bigger help. So maybe share communities that you know of in the comments down below. That would be pretty cool for the entire community. All right, guys, I'll see you next week. Same time, same place. Until next time, take care. God bless.